Who are here with Christian Forsyth, the head teacher here at uh, Woodham Community College in Newton Aircliffe. Christine, um, the school announced that um, the school will be taking uh, academy status as from the 1st of September this year. Uh, not knowing a great deal myself, looking from the outside, and that, that seems to be probably a, a great deal of change. Um, what does it mean for the school? Well, it's fantastic news for the school. Um, first of all, to convert to be an academy, you've got to prove that you're a school that's performing well. And we've had three years of improving results. This year we've had a fantastic Ofsted, and what that means is the government thinks that we are a school that is improving strongly and that we are good enough to convert to become an academy in our own right. An academy is essentially a state-run independent school and we have a lot of freedom to take the school forward how we want to take it forward for the benefit of the children in Newton Aycliffe and for the benefit of the community. So it's absolutely fantastic news. Does it make, make any change to sort of the facilities that will be available to the, to, to the students here at the school? Not, not necessarily, but in practice, in converting to an academy, we get more direct funding straight into the school. So what we have done is we, are, we have invested in digital technology and we've already converted to wireless technology and over the summer we'll be building an Apple Mac suite, buying Apple Macs, buying I iPads, so that students will have real cutting edge technology in September and is the academy conversion that's allowed us to make that investment. I was going to say, I was going to mention the digital technology because I read that and it does seem that, that schools are really embracing modern technology. How important do you think that is for the students? I think it's essential because the difficulty with technology is that it, it dates very quickly and I think it's important that any forward looking school keeps at the cutting edge of that technology, moves with the times and makes sure that the students leaving have got the most up to date knowledge possible. And we're also looking at Raspberry Pis. Um, I don't know if you know I don't know if you've come across those. That's little they're little computers about the size of the size of a credit card where you actually build it yourself. And that's looking at computer science rather than traditional ICT. So it's moving forward into that next generation of digital technology which will be necessary to help students get jobs and at the end of the day you know while we want students to be happy in school when they get to 16 they've got to move on to the next stage of employment education or training and we must have employable students i know one of the other changes will be the uniform for a start yes. the, the students will be wearing new uniforms um, but are there any other obvious uh, changes that the students will see straight away I think the, the uniform is part of a, a wider change in branding um, and that change in branding is its new logo, new colours, new uniform, there will be some interior remodelling and redecoration so the school will look different the minute you walk into it. Um, however that, that really reflects a change of emphasis in the school. We were a technology college. We will focus on digital technology, but also on all subjects. I think a school should be excellent in every respect, not just in one area. And I think the day of the old specialist college is gone. I want the school to be excellent in English, maths, sciences, the arts, humanities, sport, in every area, so that whatever a child is good at, they've got absolutely the the best education, the best teaching and the best possibility to succeed at this school.